how does it feel to break through? I mean, Lifetime doesn't get a lot of yeah. Emmy nominations in these categories. Yeah. Um, you know, I feel like when, when Sarah um, and I first sat down and talked about the show, it felt like something really fresh and new. But you never know, especially now when there's, what, 400 hours of scripted programming? Yeah. But I think that the fact that it was on Lifetime probably helped us because yeah. people were surprised to see something that edgy and weird on that network. So in a way, I think it helped us break through the clutter. But also, you know, Constance and Cheery are kind of undeniable. Um, so the combination of the subject matter and those two actresses really pushed us up. So season one, universal acclaim. Season two, a little polarizing, uh, a little, little split. Um, did you take some of that criticism like, and really read it and, and think about it and think about how you could apply it to season three? You know, I left after season one. Oh. Yeah. Oh, okay. So you're I, not involved, you weren't involved at all in season two? No, I left after. I, I co wrote the first episode and then I left. Oh, okay. I had, Are you coming back for season three? I am not. Oh, damn it. <laughs> okay. Um, but we had a great. I had a great run. Okay. I had a great run. All right.